the royal family has come under fire after it was claimed they have not attended an international football match played by a home nation other than England in two decades. The national side secured a monumental win against Denmark last night in the semi-finals of Euro 2020. And senior royals have been seen getting into the spirit of the tournament. Prince William celebrate Gareth Southgate's historic 2-0 win over Germany at Wembley and even the future king has got involved following the Three Lions 4-0 thrashing of Ukraine in the quarterfinals. Prince Charles invited the band of the Coldstream Guards to play an instrumental version of the classic football's Coming Home song at his London home Clarence House. The Prince of Wales also requested Sweet Caroline, the 1969 hit by American songwriter Neil Diamond that is often heard belted out by English fans. But some have been left frustrated that the British royals have only attended England games. It came after the national claimed, no member of the royal family has attended a football game played by a home nation other than England this century. According to the court circular, probed by the Scottish Daily newspaper. The most recent time a royal saw an international football match played by a home nation other than England was in 1998. When Prince Edward watched Scotland's World Cup game against Norway, they noted how both Wales and Scotland also qualified for Euro 2020, but no royals attended their matches. And the revelation sparked some anger online. One Twitter user noted, for those who are shocked maybe they need to remember why there's a Prince of Wales in the first place. Another, added, that's fine by me, and I hope they have no plans to watch a Wales game anytime soon. A third claimed, nobody in Scotland wanted him to be there, and a fourth chipped in, says it all really, doesn't it? The same probably goes for most of the Westminster lot too. According to the National, the royal family decided not to comment on their story, but the court circular is the official record that lists the engagements carried out by the royal family of the UK. But others online pointed out that that Prince William is the president of the Football Association, FA and has also been seen in the stands cheering on Wales in rugby as he is vice-patron of the Welsh Rugby Union. He also previously sent a good luck message to the Welsh football players after they reached the semi-final of Euro 2016. William congratulated Wales for progressing much further than England did in what appeared to be a cheeky dig at the Three Lions. Before praising the team's togetherness, passion and sense of self-belief saying it was unmatched throughout the tournament. He added, Harry and I will be watching the game from home tonight, cheering you on. We are all now celebrating your success, and hope it continues through to the final. He told them to go into the game against Portugal knowing that you have delighted thousands of new fans. In addition to the joy already brought to the millions of steadfastly loyal and incredibly vocal supporters you had before. He finished with the motto Cymru am Bythe which translates as Wales forever.